Good morning, it is another beautiful Monday, a sunny Monday in July, the last July of the year. Um, and I'm starting the weekly vlog in the guest room um, because I have a guest coming to stay tonight. I have my friend Faye from uni coming to stay um, with her little baby girl. And I'm not sure that I'll film her because she's not a vlogger, she's not into all of this sort of thing, she's not even actually on Facebook. So she probably doesn't want to be filmed and I would assume she does not want her baby filmed either. So I'm just going to film what I can today. Where's my doodles? There she is. Just now she was having like a really terrible attitude and I said if you don't adjust your attitude we're not going to go to the park. And she went I don't want to go to the park anyway and I was like well, that's all I had there. We're gonna head off, we're gonna go and get some yummies and then head off and have a bit of a picnic together, aren't we? Because then Faye's coming and we need to sort the house out for her. Get sorted. No, right, let's turn the TV off then. Being the domestic goddess that I am, rather than making a pat lunch, I'm just going to M&S to buy some sausages. Okay, so she's going with her section. I am gonna get Mexican 3D. It's my fave. Should we get a basket, Doodles? What would you like to drink? Let's go in the same queue together since I'm paying for it. Bubbles and a pat lunch. What more do you want? Dust is running to secure the bench. As you'll see, there's no one here fighting us for the, for the picnic bench, but she's running anyway. It is a bit nippy, isn't it? To eat quickly and go and play. What a lovely view for lunch. No, it's such a cool. Can you hear that? Yes, I can. Okay. <laughs> Darcy's like, yes, I can. She doesn't remember talking to the vlog. Sounds like grasshoppers or is it cicadas called in America? I think probably grasshoppers over here. We're off, we're off to the play area down here. Bump is enjoying his or her little walk, although I've just realised you will know Bump is enjoying her walk if you've watched my gender reveal. <laughs> Tansi is making a little house or something. She's been doing this for a long time. A little house. Wow, with a big stick on the top. Amazing. After a lengthy amount of time at the play park, where Darcy didn't want to come on anything until I went on everything with her, um, I decided to call it a day. We're going up a very steep hill and we're going to go get some food for Faye. Um, Buy the Tellerese. Yeah, and eat. Foolish Mummy said yes to one of those little Nutella and Go pots. I'm going to regret that in about half an hour when the sugar hits. Oh my god, yeah. this hill is so steep. Yeah. We're at the most lovely little farm shop that just has the most delicious foods. Um, and I'm over they're, they're not cherries, they're apricots. Yeah. They're disgusting, they're delicious. Have you ever tried an apricot? Right, so it's four for a pound, so choose four good ones. Here's the bag. That's a good one. Okay, if you think it's good, I think it's good. Oh, okay, that's okay, pick it up. Bad. It's not so bad. Well, it doesn't matter if they've got a little graze on the outside because it's what's on the inside that counts. Oh. Two. Serious business. That's three. three. One more. <laughs> Lovely. Put it in the trolley then. I've oh, got three, four. Great. I bought so much good stuff at the farm shop. Oh no, where's my helper gone? <laughs> she escaped. Our neighbours have got children and Doss likes to play with them and she was going to play with them but then before she did she was helping me do a little jobby weren't you? I have all, I want to play she with was them. Help, go on then you can play with them, I'll finish this off. Darcy is, oh you've done it! Thanks Darcy! Darcy is really good at emptying the washing machine and putting everything in here. What a good girl she is. Yes I'm going to have such fluffy towels. Also Emma Brummy Mummy I think you left a Harrods towel at my house, which is delicious. I look forward to keeping that forever. Thanks very much. My friend has arrived. I'm going to put down my camera for 24 hours or so, because like I said, she's not a camera person. Um, and I will see you tomorrow. 
We've had such a nice visit from Faye and her little girl. We have been to the park, um, we've had a nice dinner yesterday, and um, we've been to visit my grandma and granddad because Faye actually knows them from when I was at uni. Had a lovely time, we did a soft play, we've been busy bees, haven't we? Dot is nodding, we have. And now, we've come home with the telly on, and we're gonna do some sequin art. Do you remember these? I'll show you how far we've got so far. Does is a free spirit, so we've decided to abandon the map and just do the colours wherever we fancy. I need to have a big old tidy everywhere. It's a little bit of a mess, all of this is a mess, yada yada. Um, and then I'm gonna take it easy for the rest of the day because me and Bum are a bit tired actually. We're gonna chill out, relax. Liam's coming home about four or five, which is quite nice. I have just spent so much time folding, um, hanging, sorting, dealing with clothes. I can't even, I don't feel like my brain is functioning. That sort of thing is my least favorite thing to do in the whole world. If I, if I could pay someone to do that for me, that's what I would spend my, I mean, I suppose I could, but I mean, realistically. Anyway, uh, I've done it, I did it for about an hour and a half. Hello. Um, I'm gonna try and get this bracelet on my hand. She's so desperate to be in shot all the time. Um, and a jacket potato or something. Um, and then we're going to the playground, aren't we? Yeah. Uh, uh, our second playground of the day. It's half four. We've done a playground this morning, visited grandma and granddad, gone to soft play with um, Faye and her baby, come back, done some work, done some tidying. I think we're gonna head out again. Here I go. Here you go. Whoa! I haven't vlogged much today because I haven't done much today, but Vicky's just popped round, but at the same time that she's popped round, I've had a delivery from yeah. Snooze Pod. <laughs> da da da, here's Vicky, looking very glamorous. Da da da, I'm so excited. I'm gonna do a whole video unboxing this, I think. Really, really I'll just let you struggle on. <laughs> If you didn't know, Snooze Pod is a crib, and I haven't had one before um, because with Darcy, we just didn't have all these cool things. But loads of my friends have had them, and I've been sent one by the PR people. I'm so excited about it. <laughs> haven't filmed anything for ages. I had my roots done yesterday. It's Thursday now. Hey, little baby boy. It's Thursday now. Um, I've had a meeting with my accountant and all afternoon I've been sat upstairs doing stuff for Hello World. I'm so excited about that, I can't even tell you. Well I will, I'll tell you a lot later, but right now I've been called downstairs because, whoa, that's massive. That's what she said. Liam has made a BBQ. That is beastie, isn't it? It's a big BBQ. There we go. That is the barbecue of dreams. Where was this from, babe? It's being cute. Being cute. How? Oh, it's got a handle. Oh, yeah. Look at that. A chopping board. Is that a chopping board or a hot plate? Uh, it's a chopping board. It's got like a little storage bin underneath it. What's that for? Uh, you put your cooked food on there and it keeps it warm. Wow. And then you can put your. That's how you start a barbecue. You put the coal in the. Tin. Yes. You don't need a lot of coal then, do you? And then you've got a little bucket and very nice. Good. I'm, I'm <laughs> very exciting. Yes. I don't actually care that much about the barbecue. I was just trying to pretend to be very, very supportive because I spent a long time making it. Anyway, now I'm getting back into what I call my soft office, aka bed, and cracking on with some Hello World stuff. Good morning, it's Friday. I look very shiny. I've just got out of the shower um, and cleansed and moisturised. My sister has stayed overnight and I'm gonna wake her up. <laughs> morning has broken, blackbird has spoken. Something and something, something the something. Praise with elation, God's recreation. She loves it. Feeling a lot more like ready for the day now. Um, 
So I don't know if I've talked about this in the vlog. I don't think I have because I really haven't been picking up my camera a whole lot this week. Um, on Wednesday, Vicky was over and Darcy said, do you want to come for a barbecue? And I was like, we haven't got a barbecue planned. And she just invited her and I was like, all right. So then I decided with Vicky, I was like, why don't you come over? So her and Pete and um, the girls, Abby and Becca are gonna come over for a barbecue. And then I started inviting more people. So, <coughs> Excuse me, I did a massive cough there. So in our like group of friends, there's Vicky and Pete, and then Vicky and Pete's friends, Anna and Laura, and their two kids, and then um, a lady whose kids used to go to the same nursery as Darcy, um, and she's friends with us all, that's another Vicky. Um, and then, so, like basically the list just goes on, and two days later, we have got over 30 people coming for a barbecue tonight and I've hired a bouncy castle. Yes, that is right, in my garden right now, you can probably hear the ooh and the kids on it, there is a very large bouncy castle. Ta-da, there it is. So the focus of today now has moved slightly from get loads of housework done and sort of do loads of work to let's just have a giant party because if summer is not for having giant parties then when when bloody is is what I want to know so I'm gonna do a tiny bit of work now it's only um, 10 20 10 10 um, Vicky's downstairs I haven't just like left children abandoned on a bouncy castle Sorry, got distracted. So um, I'm just gonna check my emails to see if there's anything absolutely urgent. And if not, I think I'm gonna abandon ship and just have a fun day preparing for a giant barbecue party. Probably against my better judgment. I'm coming on. I'm gonna have a go. I'm gonna have a go. 19 weeks pregnant almost. Oh, it's not as, it's not as firm as I thought it was gonna be. Oh. Oh. Mummy's on. Yes. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I don't think I'm cut out for this. This is going to be so fun when everyone gets here, isn't it? Yes. It's going to be 14 kids. Uh, Four, honey. two, kids! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's hard. It is hard. I think Just I'm done. Hard. I don't think I can. <laughs> I don't think Make I can. the baby enjoy it yet. Yeah, the baby loves it. So I've been sent, I don't even know if I'm, if I'm recording. I can't actually see. <laughs> um, I've been sent these in my PO box. I don't even know if I'm, that, but they, <laughs> um, I'm going through my PO box. Vicky's come over. Am I even <laughs> shot? I don't know. Vicky's come over because <laughs> she wants to go through it with me. I've <laughs> That's amazing stuff. But these are the most amazing things ever. Like I can't see any, everything's just like a col colourful kaleidoscope. And I think they were from Nails Inc. They were part of like a they sent loads of stuff and I think this is from them. If if you're the brand that sent these and you're not Nails Inc, then I'm sorry. But of all <laughs> of all the things, this is amazing. I'll show you some up here box stuff. I wish hang on, if I put this on the camera. Yes! Look at this! <laughs> Hang on, let me turn it round and you can see, oh, sorry, that's just my tits there. You can see what I'm seeing. See how like crazy that is? <laughs> right, let me show you some of the cool peer box stuff. I think I'm gonna do a full haul. First of all, How to Grow a Baby by Clemmie Hooper. I actually bought this a while ago when I got pregnant, but now I've got two, so thanks very much, Clemmie, appreciate that. Um, Star things have to be Aiden and Anais, the most lovely Muslim Square company ever, um, have sent me so many lovely things, including this, a little bed. Um, hang on, let me just, let me get sorted a bit more, hang on. Here we go, Aiden and Anais, if you're interested, um, have sent the dream blanket as well as some of their swaddle cloths as well and also I have some of their lovely lovely bibs a couple of children's books whoops which I always appreciate I like bees I don't like honey by Sam Bishop and Fiona Lumbers um, and then also this the worry box by Lou Thompson which I think could be a good read um, these were sent for baby little you know the cards sort of the milestone cards and that's from Elsa so, so thank you so much um, Cheeky Chompers has sent a lovely bib with this in. Maybe I won't do a haul if I'm doing this now. Um, burpy bibs. These look, I love the metallics on these. Aiden and Ace, thank you so much. And then let me sit down. 
um, an absolute ton of stuff from Real Techniques. I love these. I have some of these already and I just love them so much. They were inspired by, I think the blue squirrel is where I've read that somewhere. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. Ah, uh, sorry, I can come in. Um, and then Burt's Bees have been very generous as well as Palmer's and said, oh my goodness, everything's falling off and sent an absolute ton, ton, ton of things for me and baby for like stretch marks like here's some of the Palmer's ones, stretch marks and um, stuff for baby which I'm so grateful for I'm going to put all of these in a little basket in baby's room um, what else do we have? we have Ollie the Owl Ollie the Owl Light and Sound Aid I also have the Grow Egg which I'm really excited about because that does temperature and it's little glow light and one of these, the classic You and the Dream Sheep so baby is well set now we're going to do the rest one more thing which I am super excited about which funnily enough Liam will be most excited about the white company <laughs> have set one of their giant candles and this is in the scent summer if you don't know this I don't think I've talked about this in the vlog mine and Liam's guilty pleasure is to go into the white company we go there's one in Milton Keynes we've been to the one in Stratford upon is it Stratford upon Avon Stony Stratford upon Avon and we just peruse the things in there and we always buy the candles and talk about how when we win the lottery we're going to buy all the bedding from there and all the things so pretty excited to show him this when he gets home he'll be so thrilled that i've said on the internet that he loves scented <laughs> candles haha <laughs> <laughs> um i would just like to say thank you so much to all the brands who send things to my PO box um oh vicky's looked in the bag on um it's what? oh no. hang on hang on just want to say thank you very much it's always much appreciated i do try and feature as much as i can on here i've got some beauty bits as well some really lovely bits from i feel like now i have to say everyone because i don't want anyone to feel miss out some lovely bits from rimmel and bourgeois have sent um some of their lovely lip stuff and the new naked heat palette <laughs> oh my god is this what is this for the baby or the cat cats the cats <laughs> I it won't put my baby in here. It's got a little. Oh, how oh, sweet! Um, what brand is this from? It's from Tigger Cozy Cushions. Oh, that is so sweet. Little update on the cats. We haven't seen Zula now for almost three weeks. He does this from time to time. He wanders off and then comes back like a week later. Oh, hello. Um, but we're hoping he'll come back. But we've still got Rocket for sure. Got two little girls. Hello. Oh my god, Maury has sent something. I have been, oh, hello Bump. I have been perusing their website for so long. Oh my god, oh my god. A little note. Save, get hold of it all. I wish that I had saved, I'm filming you now, Vicky. I wish that I had saved stuff. Did you save stuff between Abby and Becca? I did actually. Did you? Yeah, and then I look back at the photos, and then I look now even when they are different ages oh i didn't save anything from darcy because do. i know but i just didn't think that i'd be doing it again so i didn't save anything anyway look vicky look on, vicky to <gasps> oh my god is that more maury stuff yeah <gasps> touch this vicky touch it with your hands touch it oh my god how oh, tiny oh, gonna oh, i'm gonna weep i'm gonna actually cry I think you're going to actually pee your pants a little bit. <gasps> Look, oh, it's one of those, no. like, wrapped round ones. Soon there's going to be a little baby in there. Oh, huh? this one. I want to keep them all folded. Oh, my God. <gasps> and they've got little leggings as well. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at this. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh. <laughs> I want to cry. That could be like your coming home box. Oh my god, yes. Oh, I want to keep them. I know you have to wash everything before you like use it. I just want to keep everything in the boxes forever. I'm going to keep this box though, and then when the baby doesn't wear them anymore, I'm going to put them all back in the box. And then either they can have it when it's a grown up or. or oh my god, thank you, more. Oh, actually, there's more. There's more. There's more. Maury, you have been far, far, far too generous. <gasps> this is a zip one. No, oh, a sleep, sleep bag. bag. Don't worry about the girls screaming outside. It's happy screams. <gasps> this is so nice. I'm a little way so longer. Sleep. You can clip it up. Oh, oh, oh. I need to explore everything a bit more carefully. But <gasps> thank you.
that? Oh my god, imagine if this was your clothes. So soft. So soft. I'm basically just doing my haul now instead of on my main channel. A lovely, lovely Victor and Rolf perfume. Um, flower bomb. It's absolutely just the most lovely, lovely smelling perfume ever. Can you put it there? Um, a lovely children's book by Jen Campbell, illustrated by Katie Hartnett. Um, oh, that's lovely. The illustrations are really, really nice. Lovely, lovely. And then, um, Real Techniques, which you know I love, not just because I love Nick and Sam, just because I think they are amazing. I've sent these, look, Vicky, you can like stick these to your wall. And then in the bathroom or whatever, like little um, holders. Oh, I like those, they're a really good idea. Yeah. Ta -ta -da. Thank you, thank you. Weep, weep, weep. Joni has sent me some goodies. How cute is this? Jumper with a shopping bag on. Le picnic. Flipping, love it. And it will fit over bump because it's got a bit of stretch in it. Thanks, Joni. Um, I'm often wearing their stuff, so I'm really happy to sample some of these lovely, lovely things. I have got a grumpy six year old on my hands. <laughs> I can see him on the Bouncy Castle. The time, sponsored by Actress, is 20 past three, and we told everyone to come over for about six. Um, it's just me and Darcy now, Vicky's gone home. Liam will be back from work in about an hour. Um, ooh, not comfortable to sit there. Um, and I've told Darcy that it might be a good idea if she has a nap, because we're gonna be staying up late. And so she's run off to the Bouncy Castle. She's hiding at the very edge of it. I'm gonna have to go and bounce on it. I'm gonna come and bounce on it and get you. I'm coming to bounce on it and get you. <laughs> That's a nice big smile. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> so much for a nap. <laughs> just being bounced around. She's not gonna have a nap. Just being bounced around. <laughs> You're not having a nap. No one's having a nap. <laughs> Today is the best bloody day ever. I love my job so much. I have been very kindly gifted, because these are quite, um, these are expensive, um, a Duna, the next generation car seat. I'll show you the picture on the box so you know what it is, but I am going to be doing a full video just on this. So look out for that, but for now, I'll just like give you a little sneak peek I guess. So many YouTubers have these and my friend Katie from Mummy Daddy Me um, said that hers, like she couldn't live without it and basically this is a car seat and it has wheels attached to it and you can flip the wheels up so you can put it in your car with the wheels on, excuse my massive headband, and you don't have to like click this into a base. You can have an ISO fix for it. I don't know if this comes with an ISO fix but if it doesn't I'll just buy it um, to put in your car so then this obviously folds down. Basically, it's a car seat that converts into a little pushy round stroller. It's not what I'm going to be using as my main push chair because I am like push chair crazy. Um, oh, look, we just got a close picture of the wheels and stuff. I've done it. She's gone down for a little nap. Hopefully, she'll get an hour in and then she'll enjoy the barbecue so much more. Right, I'm going to. Oh gosh, was I just filming my boobs again? Sorry, guys. Um, I am going to just sort of potter around, tidy up a bit, just enjoy having a little bit of quiet time. Oh my goodness. I went shopping the other day to Cath Kids and I bought the baby bag. This video has turned into, oh my god, turned into tits and bags. Bags and tits. That should be my new screen name. Bags and tits. Right, um, going to just sort through some of the PO box goodies that I've been given and do some work and just. <sighs> Bump and I are going to have a little rest too. <laughs> it started pouring it down. We've got an hour to go until everyone gets it. Until like 30 people descend on us. Oh, it's not focused. And it's raining, so I need to go and rescue all the um, patio seat cushions. Um, so that if it stops raining, I can put them back on. Oh my goodness. Right. Okay. The sun has come back out. People have started arriving. Pete's admiring. Liam's BBQ. Oh yes. What an action shot that was. Wow. That That's a hot bucket, babe, isn't it? It is, yeah. Red Sexy Pete, bucket. what do you think to the new barbecue? Red hot. Yeah, official <laughs> review. Here we go. Oh, we've got more people here. Hello. Hello. Hello, guys. This is not a Capri Sun. 
It looks a lot like a Capri Sun. I'm so it. jealous. I'm getting in every shot, aren't you? <laughs> Nice column. I'm ready for one of those. Mm. You've done a good job, babe. Ones without cheese. Would that be Russian roulette or what? Uh, what do you mean ones? Oh, but they've got a cheese in there. I'm not putting on yet. Which one? Cheese? Yeah. So they're all cheese. No, no, none of them are cheese. These are burgers, Al. What are you talking about cheese? It's, it's burgers with cheese in them. Cheddar burgers. Oh, that's half right. Yeah. Ladies. Hello. Zest our internet sensation. I'm trying your your veggie jobby. It looks beautiful like your soul. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna steal your seat as soon as you get up. Yeah. Bouncy castle is worth its weight in gold. There's a lot of happy kids. This is the boys' barbecue area. Very important for them all to stand there and watch burgers be cooked. Oh look, this is the carnage. We've got a few people, a few stragglers left in the kitchen. And then some, I don't know how they're still going. My neighbors probably hate me. Let's see how the barbecue's doing. Oh God, I've got a lot of tidying up to do. Oh yes, yes. I'm gonna end it here for the week um, and just put the camera down. Why does my skin look so weird? It's the lighting, it's the lighting, it's the lighting. Um, I'll end it here and I'll see you all next week.